Let's bring in trial attorney Michael Jaffer, who is standing by. Michael, we're hearing this all-important testimony from the medical examiner, the word strangulation, really key here because blunt force trauma is one thing, especially when we know what the defendant has said to police, but strangulation something totally different. Completely agree, and it's so emotional to hear this testimony. They're taking you through a blow-by-blow -blow analysis of the last moments of this poor woman. Uh, and then the police officer just saying that, uh, interviewing him and saying, you cried, you gave fake tears here for seven hours. You, had, you didn't shed one tear, you pretended to cry for seven hours. Uh, um, this is a muscular man, it's a big, it's a big man. Uh, he had the motive. Um, I don't see what the defense is going to be. Look, from my days as a court-appointed defender, sometime, and I'm not saying he has a public defender, I would be given cases by judges and they said, this person is entitled to a defense. You got to defend this person. And sometimes I'd have clients who didn't listen to me and wanted to pursue a path that I thought was terrible, right? Um, so I would chalk this up to the category of the defense attorneys here. This is the worst of the worst in defending a person because you have almost no options. I'm very curious to see what they come up with. Um, but yeah, this is very, very jarring to listen to. And her ear almost pulled off, her eyes are gone. Yeah. He got deep into her tissue and the bones, it's, it's, it's sad. It really is sad all around. Michael Jaffer, thank you so much for your analysis. We are gonna get you to a break